dear students today we are going to discuss something about direct and indirect speech so let us see here i have written a sentence here ram says i am a doctor so this one ram says this is known as the reporting part my dear this is known as the reporting part similarly another part is here that is i am a doctor this is the reporting part this part is known as reporting part so first of all we should confirm that here the sentence ram says comma in what it comma starts i am a doctor in what comments and full stop so here there are two parts this part is known as reporting part that is ram says similarly i am a doctor this part is known as reported part so here we have to do what basing upon this reporting part and reported part we have a formula write down the formula if the reporting part is in present tense or in future time my dear if the reporting part is in present tense or in future time then there will be no change in the tense of the reported part while changing into a into indirect speech means while changing it into indirect speech there will be no change in the tense of the reported part so suppose here this is direct speech okay now i'm saying i am a doctor so in indirect speech that is is we have to write ram says ram says we have to use that we have to use that instead of comma and inverted comma so ram says that i am a doctor here i becomes he he and we have to use the helping verb is with he because there will be no change in the tense of the reported part because the reported part is in present tense ram says this is simple present says so ram says that he is a doctor this is the indirect speech similarly another sentence lila lila says i had gone there i had gone there lila says i had gone there so lila says this is the reporting part i had gone there that is the reported part so this is our direct speech in direct speech it is written that lila says i had gone there here the reporting part is in present tense and the reported part is in past perfect you see i had gone there this is past perfect so here lila says this is simple present okay so there will be no change in the tense of the reported part so the indirect speech will be lila Says that I become smart. See, and the book, the boy had see had gone there. And the sentence is here. Layla says that see had gone there. And we take another example that is known as in direct speech. You will write here. Jatin will say. Jatin will say, "I am a boy." Jatin will say, "I am a boy." So here, Jatin will say, "This is the reporting part," and "I am a boy." This is reporting part. So the indirect speech will be, Jatin will say. we have to use that in the place of i we have to use he and with he the verb is is he is a boy so simply we wrote here jatin will say that he is a boy there is no change in the 
dash i am going he is a boy the tense is present tense because the reporting part is will really here and the formula says if the reporting part is in present tense or in future time then there will be no change in the tense of the reported so this was all about formula 1 so now see formula 2 what is the formula write down if the reporting part is in past tense mind it if the reporting part is in past tense then there will be a change in the tense of the reported part while converting it into indirect speech means what suppose we write here ram said s a i d s h e d ram said i am hungry i am hungry the sentence is like this ram said i am hungry so ram said this is the reporting part i am hungry this is the reported part as for formula 2 say ram say this is in past tense in simple past so there will be a change in the tense of the reported part so what will be the sentence in indirect speech you will write here ram say that instead of comma and inverted comma we have to use what that ram say that he was what he was hungry so we wrote here what ram said that he was hungry similarly another example raghu say common postures i am boy you see the sentence here raghu said i am boy so this is in simple past and this is in simple present but we have to change the tense of the reported part how because this is said so the sentence will be raghu said that instead of i we have to use he similarly instead of am we have to use was because he plus was he was going he was going so raghu said i am going raghu said that he was going similarly another example in direct speech you have to write i say it is a pen i say it is a pen so here it is a pen it is in simple present but i say this is in simple past so in indirect speech we have to write i said that it was a pen but a pen is always pen so it is a general thing the general truth so we may write i said that it is a pen so this sentence is correct in both this sentence in both the senses first is i said that it was a pen this is also correct similarly if you say i said that it is a pen this is also correct so regarding this we are getting some other formulas that will be discussed in our next class This much today. Thank you.